There's a great phrase and approach to wrestling that will help your athletes. So as a parent or a coach, it's good that you talk about this constantly. Once a week, maybe uh, I've, I've had kids who have printed this off and um, you know on a piece of paper and they read it before their matches. Just totally immerse yourself in adopting the right approach so that you can have the best um, wrestling that you can have. So here we go. This is a, just a reminder email I send out to our um, people who are on our newsletter. You can email me, nick at perlerwrestling.com to get added to that. Um, it's pretty useful, I think. Here we go, here's our approach. Constantly remind your wrestlers how to get ready and that their approach needs to be this. Our approach is here. I will wrestle smart, tough, and score points. That's all we're gonna focus on. I plan to have the best wrestling stance in America and I plan to score first or no one's gonna score. I always plan to get off bottom. See, that's our main talking points. Wrestle smart, tough, score points. That's it, wrestle smart. We wanna be the smartest wrestlers in America. That doesn't mean we don't want to wrestle hard. Wrestling hard is a given, right? You have to study hard to get a, a degree. You have to work hard to get a job, right? You have to work hard as a parent. So let's just not use the, you have to work hard. Everybody works hard, but uh, only a few people win. Why is that, right? So yeah, work hard, duh. Don't tell me anything I don't know, right? Let's focus on what? Being the smartest wrestlers in America, being tough because Toughness will just get you through anything, right? Tough it out when you're tired. Tough it out when you when you need to take down. Tough it out when you have to shed that last pound before weigh-ins. Tough it out when the ref makes a bad call, right? So being tough is just, uh, it's the foundation. And I'm always, always looking to score points. That way I'm keeping a task mind, I'm keeping a task brain, you know, focusing on what I need to do to score, that's it. So the wrestling smart, tough, and scoring points, that's been our mantra for two decades. Um, my style or system to winning, you know, my system to winning matches is this. Have the best dance in America, have the best dance in America. I score first or no one does, and I always get off bottom. That's the things I focus on. Best dance in America, score first, get off bottom. This is all I'm gonna focus on. Now, whatever happens, happens. We like to say that too. My approach is to focus on these aspects and whatever happens, happens. After I do these, I'll be happy with the outcome. Whatever happens, happens doesn't mean that you're okay with losing or that you don't care, obviously. Whatever happens, happens means you're giving up and surrendering on the worry. Dude, I can't worry about anything else. So, you know, you might get struck by lightning today can't worry about it. I'm not going to walk walk out on the golf course with a lightning uh, rod in my hand when it's uh, a thunderstorm. But you know, I mean, I'm going to do I'm going to avoid those stupid situations. But you know, I'm not going to hide in my house because I'm afraid to get struck by lightning. Bad things can happen. I'm not, I can't worry about that. Give up. Give up on worrying about it. Accept it, right? I have to accept the fact that this match is going to start the ref might make a bad call. My opponent might do something good and get me. That's fine, I have to come back from behind. I might have to pull the match out in the third period. I'm ready for anything. Let's just get this match started. I'm gonna try to keep the match under tight control. My focus is to wrestle smart and tough and score points. When I do that, the lightning uh, flashes and fireworks happen. And, 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 and you know, I'm tough to beat when I do that. I know that for a fact. I'm gonna make sure I double down on having the best wrestling stance in America. I want people all over the nation to talk about me. I wanna be amazing at scoring the first takedown. If I can't get the first takedown, that's gonna happen on occasion. He's, my opponent certainly is not gonna score on me. We'll go 0-0 first period because I am that hard headed. And I always make sure I get off bottom. No matter how I get there, I'm getting off bottom. These are my uh, talking points, my sort of phraseology how I'm wrapping my mind around my system to becoming a world-class wrestler. And uh, whatever ha happens beyond that, I refuse to worry about. Whatever happens, happens. I'm not going to worry about it. I'm not even gonna discuss it because my focus is better off right here, not worrying about the unknowns. You know, I know that in wrestling, I'm much like a quarterback. I have a game plan. The, uh, the coach calls the play. I call the play to my team. Once we snap the ball, the whole thing can go awry. I have to figure out um, 
how to move the ball down the field a lot of times on the fly, right? So wrestling is a wrestler is much like a quarterback. Once the ref blows a whistle, I might have a game plan, but it may not work. I might have to figure the match out as I go, and I totally accept that. I actually like it better that way, right? So, uh, you know, all the pre-planning and, you know, I, I can't plan the match out ahead of time. I have a rough game plan, and that's all I have. I'm fine with that. I don't think beyond that. My coaches and parents know that they don't have me on remote control. They can't yell moves at me like, uh, uh, you know, 100 moves a, 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 a match from the sideline. They can't remote control me through the match. They know they need to sit down and be quiet, let me do the job. Right, so I've got them in check, I've got myself in check, and I'm ready to perform. This is the approach that will win you matches, and uh, you can certainly check out more at PerlerWrestling.com. If you wanted to train with us, Chico might actually be there. He's my buddy. He always works right here, right? So uh, you might even get to meet Chico Boy if you're uh, if you're lucky. You can check us out at PerlerWrestling.com. We'd love to have you. Got our own 18,000 square foot training center. Kids coming from Alaska, Hawaii. Our camps are sold out nearly every year for 16 years. We have girls camps now. Every weekend we have a competition. Our one week in a month we have a competition camp. Private team camps. So we send coaches all over the nation. We have our online academy, the world's first online academy. Uh, I guess 24 athletes in the Division One uh, national tournament last year that trained with us. So. Um, I feel like PerlerWrestling.com is the place to be if you want to be great. But if you want to train with us um, in our summer camps, probably want to get in early. Those Some of those sell out fast. Um, we also have our academy, right? We have our uh, beginners. Uh, then we have our academy. Then we have our elite room. Then we have a world-class wrestler room. So we have four academy programs that we offer. And uh, some of our rooms have over 30 state champs in them. So it's kind of a freak show to get into our more advanced rooms. But um, we don't recruit. Uh, we take anybody who wants to be great. If our athletes lose to a great wrestler, we don't chase that great wrestler and his mommy and daddy down the hallway throwing business cards at them. That's silly. We don't do that. We chase our wrestler down the hallway and we talk to those parents and, those, and we say, let's regroup. How do we get better? How do we beat this kid? Let's do better. Let's do this. Let's watch the match. Let's break it down. So complete loyalty to um, to our athletes winning. But anybody that wants to get involved certainly can at PerlerWrestling.com. So a lot going on. Check us out.